do, just the two of us. Let's talk about making movies. You can't go through life not seeing a truly great production of epic proportions like Ben-Hur. There's nothing bigger than Ben-Hur. Everyone knows that, baby. Well, I've been here. Yes, well, you know, babe, for this kind of material, I could charge $300. Well, what do you reckon about that? Okay, then. I think I could charge $500 for sex. So where's my $200 change? But, baby, remember that expensive handbag I bought you just recently? Cost me a lot of money. Well, then again, Mr. Generous One, if I was you, I wouldn't exactly equate sex with you buying me stuff. Because if you do, then you still owe me big time, bud. Well, I don't really mind if you're still legally married, Mrs. Crawford. You can be Mrs. Tim Buck, too, for all I care, and I would still love you. Well, I do really mind if you're a Mr. Robinson, so long as you are no Hugh Hefner. A two second wonder. Babe, please, don't ever call me Hugh Hefner. Hugh Grant, maybe. Babe, you know that I don't take you for granted. Nice one, Bob. Seriously, G. Actually, you're very similar looking to that actor we watched in that movie Kill the Irishman the other night. Yes, and you're the Heidi Claim of the Philippines. Give me a break. I'm a lot better than that, aren't I? Yes, babe, you are. But he's in a better position. Just remember, darling, you're the one watching him. Hmm, but babe, I have some other great qualities too, like my writing ability, just for one. Remember how I was selling stuff online just the other day? The way I described the items for sale was just pure magic. It was great stuff. People loved it. Look how many hits I got. I'm a genius in the making. Very true, Frank Einstein, but I really think they were more interested in buying your stories. Yes, yes, really, G. What do you reckon is my best quality? What? Physically? Yes, that too. Well, I guess it would have to be your leadership quality, but could be your worst too. So, baby, I guess I would be the best possible man to get you out of any tight situation. What do you reckon about that? Yes, and you're probably the man that would put me there in the first place. Come on, babe, let's wind this up. You know how I hit cameras in my face. But, and you know that the show must go on, just like the dynamic duo we truly are. Not to be confused with Batman and Robin, of course. More like Batwoman and Rollins.